हेलो दोस्तों आप लोगों का स्वागत है हमारे चैनल टेक्लोर्स पे सो uh, so, आज हम डिस्कस करेंगे वाई वी चंदचूट जी के बारे में सो so, शुरू करने से पहले आप लोगों से रिक्वेस्ट है प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब द चैनल एंड चलिए शुरू करते हैं सो वाई वी चंदचूट जी का पूरा नाम यशवंत विष्णु चंदचूट जी था एंड ही वॉज बॉर्न ऑन ट्वेल्थ जुलाई नाइनटीन ओके एंड उनका एक बड़ा फेमस कोट है ही से इट इज़ नॉट एन ईजी जॉब माई बिगेस्ट अचीवमेंट इज़ दैट आई एम लिविंग एन अनडिवाइडेड कोट फॉर माई सक्सेसर सो वाई चंद वाई वी चंद चूट जी ने ये कोट कहा एंड ही वॉज वेरी फेमस वाई वी चंद चूट जी के बारे में हम बात करते हैं तो वाई वी चंद चूट जी का जन्म पुणे में हुआ था इंडिया में एंड ही ऑप्टेन हीज लॉ डिग्री फ्रॉम द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ लॉ कॉलेज ऑफ मुंबई ही वॉज बोर्न इन नाइनटीन July, I think, and uh, he began his legal career in 1943, practicing in the Bombay High Court, and was appointed judge of Bombay High Court in 1961. So he was later appointed Chief Justice of Supreme Court in 1972. He began his legal career in 1943, practicing in the Bombay High Court, and was appointed a judge of the Bombay High Court in 1961. and he was later appointed the chief justice of india so during his tenure as a chief justice of india chanchur ji made several landmark judgment that have significant impact on the indian law unhone bahut sare aise judgment diye hain jo ki landmark judgment the aur jinka indian law pe kafi impact bhi hai ek significant impact hai indian law ke upar he presided over several important cases including the landmark ADM Jabalpur versus Shivkant Shukla case, which deal with the suspension of the fundamental right during a state of emergency, and uh, Chanchurji was also member of several international organization, including the International Commission of Jurists and the World Association of Judges. He was awarded the Padma Vibhushan Indian Second Highest Civilization Award in 1960. 86 in the recognition of his contribution in the field of law and chanchurji was known for his legal acumen integrity and a commitment upholding the principle of justice and fairness he passed away on 14 july 1989 leaving behind a legacy as one of the india's most respected and influential jurist so he was very influential and he was respected among the people his landmark judgment including minerva mill limited versus union of india 1980 where he had laid down how a balance between fundamental right and direct principle had to be achieved so inhone yahan pe bataya ki fundamental right aur direct principle ko kaise balance kiya ja sakta hai there should be a harmony relationship between the fundamental right and direct principle and if it's necessary then fundamental right can override the direct principle but we should have to between like try to maintain a relationship between fundamental right and direct principle and there is another judgment he gave uh, gurbak singh sibba versus state of punjab 1980 clearly show the empathy for the criminal law where he had laid down the law of anticipatory bail you know anticipatory bail ke upar uh, ek law diya and he ha- he had held that anticipatory bail must be left to judge who have to experience to take a wise decision so unhone isme bola ki anticipatory bail should be discretion on the uh, judges uh, and on their discretion so they took the wise decision and give the anticipatory bail and his land another landmark judgment mohammad ahmed khan versus shahbano begum 1985 he is a very famous and landmark judgment where he had ruled that divorce of muslim women were entitled to claim maintenance from husband under the civil procedure court which overrides the muslim personal law so inhone muslim personal law ko override karte hue bola ki civil procedure court ke under muslim women can claim the maintenance from the husband okay and there is a one fam- another famous judgment from him olga telis versus bombay municipal corporation so um, uh, 1985 so where he had extended article 21 right to life for the contribution uh, constitution to some developers ruling that they had the right to roof over their head aur yahan pe inhone judgment diya ki under article 21 
द सलम डेवलर्स जो सलम एरिया में रहने वाले हैं जो पटपट्टी वाले हैं में रहने वाले लोग हैं दे ऑल्सो हैव द राइट टू रूफ ऑन देयर हेड तो उनको भी अधिकार है कि उनके छत सर पे छत हो एंड द फेमस केस वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द ई डी एम जबलपुर वाइल लुकिंग टू द जजमेंट ऑफ वन कैन टर्न ए कैन टर्न ए ब्लाइंड आईज टू वर्ड द केस ऑफ ए डी एम जबलपुर वर्स एच शुक्ला नाइनटीन सेवेंटी सिक्स फेमसली नोन एज द हेबस कॉर्पस केस विच हैड फेमस फॉर द रॉन्ग रीजन वेयर ही अलॉन्ग विद द जस्टिस पी एन भगवती हैव डिसाइड द राइट टू लाइफ इट सेल्फ कुड बी सस्पेंडेड ड्यूरिंग एन एमरजेंसी इवेंट टू on the become chief justice and later apology for the decision justice bhagwati also publicly repented for the same so isme justice bhag pn bhagwati ne bhi bola ki unko bada pashtawa hai unhone ye judgment diya ki article 21 ko unhone during emergency suspend kiya and uh, he is also say like unhone bhi bola he is a pub, uh, अब उन्होंने अपोलॉजी मांगी माफ़ी मांगी अपने डिसीजन के लिए चीफ जस्टिस बनने के बाद में कि उन्होंने आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी वन को सस्पेंड किया ड्यूरिंग इमरजेंसी सो थैंक यू फॉर द वॉचिंग द वीडियो लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब द चैनल एज वेल थैंक यू वेरी मच